We're following breaking news from overnight. Austin police shooting and killing a man near 6th Street. It happened right around 1 o'clock this morning. Let's go back to Kate Whitehall, who's been live at the scene since uh, 4 30 this morning. Kate? Good morning. Yeah, 21 year old man is dead. And if you are headed downtown this morning, you're going to notice a very active crime scene. You see, we're at 7th and Trinity. Police tape everywhere down here, but it's more of a scene down on 6th Street. That is where this all started around 1220 last night when police were called to some fights happening at Terminal 6. That's a club where a concert was taking place last night. So that's what led police there, but it wasn't until after one they started receiving 911 calls about shots being fired in the alley way directly behind the club. So when officers started heading that direction, Chief of Staff Troy Gay with APD tells us officers heard those shots and so they took cover and when they went around the corner to look to see what was happening, they saw a man running at them with a gun in his hand. He tells us that they told him to drop the weapon multiple times. He did not. Eight officers fired their weapons at him. One used their taser. And we talked to Chief Gay about the fact that they were able to see all of this on video. Tonight was, was a very, very dynamic situation, uh, which involved video footage from multiple cameras, uh, both from our public safety cameras, as well as from body-worn cameras. Uh, I do want to let you know that the incident the officer involved shooting as well as other incidents were all captured on footage tonight. And the man's name who died has not been released. They did perform CPR down here first, transferred to Del Seton Medical Center where he later died. Of course, we're continuing to ask questions from APD throughout the day. Back to you.